Hello everyone, welcome to our brand new Mini 3 Unveil video channel where we will feature and talk about model cast collectibles. A short introduction of myself, I'm Colin, the content creator on Mini 3 Garage Facebook and Instagram page. If you have not followed us, you can do so on the link below. Our page features a wide variety of model cars, collectibles and information to keep you up to date to the hobby. Now back to Mini 3 Unveil. First of all, we would like to thank Tarmac Works for sending these awesome models for us to review today. On our very first Mini 3 Unveil, we will take a look at Tarmac Works' first ever Owners Club membership car, the first Australia RWB 930 Southern Cross. This car model is based on the first Australia RWB that Nakaya Sun built. Let's take a look at uh, Tarmac Works RWB 930 Southern Cross. This 164 RWB 930 is Tarmac Works Owners Club first membership car. Tarmac Works have uh, limited this model to 1,500 pieces. The model comes in a specially constructed Owners Club box. Inside the box, there is the box RWB and a metal membership card. The card is serialized and it comes with uh, lots of benefits. For more information about the benefits, please check the Tarmac Works link below. Alright, let's get going. Let's start with the packaging. This is the number 7 RWB in Tarmac Works lineup. Its box and acrylic case is uh, same as any regular Tarmac releases. Except for the artwork, it is printed with uh, pink RWB logos and wordings. Let's take a look inside. As usual, the car is mounted on a black plastic base, filled with uh, printed car information. Tarmac has also made effort to improve on the outlook of the base by creating unique artworks to fit the car profile. For this uh, RWB, they have printed uh, kangaroos or wallaby image to match the profile of this uh, Australia RWB. Observing the details of this car, I'm impressed with Tarmac's effort on the fine printed uh, details on the RWB. Like the small prints on the front and the back bumpers, and the RWB logos below the banana wing. The car plate is also spotted with a uh, 576M which is, uh, if I'm not wrong, is the same as the actual car. I also love the pink uh, little ribbon prints on the Hakama side skirt. The application of the rivets and the wings on the fender also define the outline of the car which uh, lifted the overall shape of the whole car. I'm most impressed with the gold color Workmeister uh, M1 rim and the idler prints on the tire. Those fine details on the wheels really bring its realism to another level. In my opinion, it's never easy to work those details on the 164 scale, especially when you have to keep those details on the thin tire. And keeping the ratios between the tires and the rim accurate, and yet it does not get stuck within the fenders. I did say Tarmel Works have done a pretty fine job on this. Overall, this pink color RWB does bring a refreshing breath to the current RWB lineup. If you have followed me on Facebook or Instagram page, in my photographs and displays, I love to add in the 164 uh, figures and uh, items to enhance the realism and outlook of the setup. So in Mini 3 Unveil, I will share some photo ideas and uh, skill items for you to have fun with your collections. This week I received this set of figures from Figure Workshop. Just a short introduction. Figure Workshop produced high quality 164 resin figures and all their figures are hand-painted by the creator himself. In my opinion, their figures has a very natural posture and excellent body expressions that fits into your storytelling images. So this set of our Streetwalker series, they introduced two female and two male figures, which is a, a new design to their lineup, clothed with uh, streetwear, which you can uh, match it with a variety of model car. I really love how they create figures uh, with a very unique posture, as compared to uh, some other brands, which uh, just standing posture which is like a pole or a stick man and their paint work does uh, add value to the overall outlook for those uh, who are interested in the figures please check the link below okay that's a wrap for today's uh, mini 3 unveil if you have any questions or any feedbacks please feel free to leave a comment below or pm us on our facebook or instagram page if you like what we are doing Please subscribe uh, to our YouTube channel and follow us on uh, Facebook and Instagram. Thanks for watching this episode of Mini 3 Unveil. Hope you like it. Bye!